כמובן, על פי מה שבוער באותו מאמר של תפריש נ"ג, בבירור המעלה שקלמה לעולם. התורה קלמה לעולם, ושם כמובן נדרש ארז העל, שזה שאלפיים שנה התורה קלמה לעולם. להיות, כי התורה כעולם זה עניין של מידות, העולם הוא מידות, אבל התורה מגיעה מהמוחים. ורייסה נוכח מנופקס, התורה יוצאת מהמוחים. והנה, אומר, מהלשון של רז"ל, אלפיים שנה קדמה קורה לעולם, מובן שהקדימה אשר תורה לעולם היא דווקא הפרש של אלפיים שנה, ולא אין ארוך, לא כאילו אין סוף. שזה לכאורה לא מובן, כי הרי התורה היא באין ארוך לעולם. כמו שכתוב, ואהיה אצלו שעשועים לפניו ונעלמה מעין כל חי. שזה מדבר על התורה, שהתורה נעלמה מעין כל חי, היא באין ארוך אלינו, שאנחנו לא יכולים לכפות אותה, אז איך אפשר להגיד שהיה רק אלפיים שנה? אלא שהתורה היא באמת אינסופית, אבל זה למעלה. וכשהתורה יורדת אלינו, אז היא, היא עדיין נשארת בהפרש של אלפיים שנה. בגלל שהיא אינסופית למעלה, לכן גם כשהיא יורדת למטה, היא נשארת בהפרש של אלפיים שנה. ויובן גם בעניין קדימת המוחים המידות. הרבי יביא עכשיו דוגמה מההבדל בין מוחים למידות. הרבי מיד מרגיש שזה לא כל כך דוגמה שונה, כי מוחים למידות זה אותו עניין שאנחנו מדברים עליו של אלפיים שנה קדמה תורה לעולם. There are three partners in the creation of a person. God, his father, and his mother. At this point, and he's uh, nervous enough with me to let go of Zaman, partially now, but practically in about a half a year when he goes to yeshiva, will now say a few words. I'd like to thank each and every one of you for coming and all the effort that it involved in coming. We have also guests from out of town, from far and near, and we really feel like you are our family. And we thank, thank you so, so much, much for coming. So, Mavuka, and thank you to all. I hope you'll forgive me. Tonight I will address the Bar Mitzvah boy to Zalman directly. Zalman? I remember that evening like last night. It was a Wednesday night at 4.12 a.m. to be exact, when we became the proud parents, the proud partners with Hashem in the creation of our beautiful miracle named Zalman. The birth of every child is very special, but Zalman was our first. And being that myself and Tati are both the oldest in our family, you made a whole balagan in our whole family. You turned me and Tati into parents, our parents into buddies and babies, sub and saftas. You made our grandparents into great-grandparents, all your uncles and aunts. Everyone got a new title because of you, because of little Zalman. The excitement was tremendous. I remember your first smile, your first step, the first spoon of food, and the picture with your face splattered with mashed bananas. <laughs> I remember you learning the olive base and teaching it to Mushka as well. Your first day in school, the first Mishnah that you memorized by heart, your first Gemara class, and a lot more. Every step of the way was so exciting for us as parents, and we rejoice in your joys. We're not just watching how you grow, but we're also standing on the side and guiding you along the Torah way. And I hope we can say that we did our best. With Hashem's help, I'm sure we can say. And now you are Bar Mitzvah. 
Tonight is the night we've waited for 13 years and it's finally here. Our Zalman, today you are an independent boy, confident who stands tall, ready to take upon yourself the obligation of the 613 mitzvahs. We wish you lots of success, Zalman, and we know you will succeed. We also know that you are very proud in your role of our shlichos here as a shliach yourself. And we appreciate that you see yourself doing the same. That is the best gift we could ever expect. We hope and pray that you will continue giving us and all of our family, and of course the Rebbe, lots of nachas as you continue growing as a chayl, as a true soldier in Hashem's army. We love you dearly. I got, even the biggest, is um, those who purchased fill-in or spotted to put them more recently. Now you would say, of course, he's the son of the rabbi, so he needs to say that's fill-in, that's fill-in, isn't it? 
as present. Why, why is it really the, the best that I got? In Midrash it says, Amru Yisrael Lifnei HaKadosh Baruch Hu, Ribbono Shel Olam, Rotsim Anu Liga Batora Yomam Valayla, Aval En Anu Knai, which it means, Jews said to God, God, we want to learn Torah day and night, but we don't have time for it. And Hashem answers them, instead of learning Torah, put on filling. And it would be as if you were learning to over day and night. This, this was um, the point, the beginning of the mama that I said at Ed. Um, and truthfully, the whole mama is about the, that point, that feeling are very special and they could switch learning Torah day and night. And also uh, other things about fitting that were mentioned in, in, in that Mahamar. Such a special mitzvah that could switch learning Torah day and night, it could be a big present for me. Because when you think about it, how many times it takes to put filling? five, seven minutes, and as you do it more, you get more trained, it could take an even shorter time. And that is switching, could switch, learning Torah day and night. Um, and I wanted, I want also to say thank you my parents, uh, my mommy and Tati, that helped me all the way until here. I wanted to thank my rabbi in school that teach me a lot by the last year. And also, each and every one of you, the whole community. If you weren't here, I wouldn't have come to stand here. So thank you so very much. And I also wanted to mention my grandparents and my uncles and aunts that unfortunately because of COVID aren't here. But we remember you. You are in our heart. Now we can see you over here physically. But I hope and we hope that we would see you again together with Betam Gdachas Machine when there would be no more sickness and everyone could be together. Thank you. Yes, Dominic mentioned the uh, presents that he got, and I'll say again, thank you on behalf of Zaman and the family for absolutely unexpected. I know it is a tradition, but I did not expect this coming in such mess, and this is before we even opened the envelope. Thank you very, very, very much. It is symbolic, of course, the presence of you here is uh, meaningful on its own, but uh, every single thing adds. Um, the present that Zaman was talking about, I did not manage to reach to each and every one of you individually yet. And we're still working on this. And that is in connection to the uh, great occasion of Zaman's Bar Mitzvah. We're trying to increase awareness of this great mitzvah of Tzvillin. Eleven people in our community have purchased a pair of Tzvillin. And we also wanted to give each and every one coming here tonight with a Tzvillin bag. So some bags are ready, some bags are half ready. You can see them there on zone. Uh, up to 35 bags by now. And some are sent and not yet back. Don't ask with the Hebrew and the English and the mistakes and the misunderstanding. But um, if you got a bag tonight, 
I'm, I'm glad if you saw your bag and you'll get a piece we can block you. But if you haven't seen your bag or you haven't heard from me about this, please don't be embarrassed. Most of the hard work is already beyond. <laughs>